In this video, we're going to talk about Backstage.com, the casting site, and all-around resource for actors. I'm trying to contain myself because I love Backstage so much. I do, I, I do, I really do. Okay, I have to be honest, Backstage is my number three spot for finding auditions in the acting world. If you did not hear my number one and my number two choice, go ahead and click the I right above so you can hear all of that great information. Now guys, the reason why it's number three is because it's so much more than a casting site. So much more. There are so much resources on Backstage that are gonna be helpful to new actors, old actors, actors, all of the actors. It just has everything. Okay, we're supposed to be here talking about casting sites, so let me talk about the casting part of Backstage first, and then we'll get into all of the other goodness. Okay, so if you're going on Backstage to submit for jobs, you're going to see a lot of industrials, you're going to see a lot of student films, a lot of independent films, some spec commercials. So those are the commercials that are going to be like on the internet, but not really on television. Um, you'll also see industrials. Those are internal videos. So the videos that won't necessarily be used commercially, but they might be used on the inside of a hotel for education amongst the employees. And you'll also, of course, see theater shows. There are a lot of theater shows that advertise on Backstage for auditions as well. Overall, Backstage is probably my favorite formatting and the way that it looks. It just looks pretty. It's easy to use. The formatting is very simple. Backstage costs about $20 a month. If you want to do it yearly the cost comes down a little bit again it's totally worth it there's a lot of resources on this site and if you're just starting out it's probably my number one pick for you backstage is really the place you want to be when you're just getting started because it is the favorite place for finding all of those independent films student films things like that and because the competition is low with auditioning for things like that your chance of booking something bigger is higher which means very quickly you can get together some footage that will help you look like a professional in this industry now when you think about student films and independent films and all of those things not all are created equally so you do want to do your research and making sure that you are partnering with a company or a group of people that you believe in and that you align with morally backstage is not going to have a lot of those bigger roles it won't have anything on network television or any national commercials. And for that reason, some people might shy away from backstage. But I hope what I said about all of the opportunity is enough to keep you. And if that is not, then the resources will be. So I've already told you that there are tons and tons of articles on Backstage. For anything that you might have a question on, they have an article about it. It's a great resource for you to learn about things that you have questions on, and they also keep a lot of news on there as well. So when something big is happening on the industry, that's the perfect place for you to check to see what's going on, see what people are saying about it. There's also this really interesting tab called Community where there are boards that you can have discussions on about things that you might have questions about. Maybe you have a question about a certain agency that you aren't sure if you should work with because they don't look legit, you've had a couple of uncomfortable feelings, but you're not sure. It's a great place for you to ask a question. There might be someone on the community board already who mentioned their experience with them. Backstage also has a YouTube channel, which is pretty good. I love it so much. Now the people who write these articles online are pretty amazing. Um, I've worked with quite a few teachers who have articles on the site. People like Denise Simon and Larry Silverberg who have really good reputations when it comes to the industry. All right, there you have it. You know all of the reasons why I love Backstage so much. Even though it's my number three choice for a casting website, it is my number one choice for a casting and resource. So thank you for joining me. Hit the like button, hit subscribe, and as always, thank you so much. Wishing you love, light, and all that jazz.